Hi guys, so this is Neha, back to you guys to uh, discuss one more topic of Active Directory which is Active Directory Trust. So what is trust? Trust is, you guys are watching my videos, I am explaining you what is what and you guys are trusting me with whatever I am going to explain is right. That is called trust. Same concept works here in Active Directory wherein one object, let's say user, can go ahead and access the resources like printer of another domain or another forest that is what we call trust now there are different kinds of trust which we have so in this video we are going to actually discuss what is active directory trust and what kind of trust do you have or do we have an active directory so active directory trust is trust between domains in the same forest or it could be domains of different forest or it could be within two forests. So let's say we have two forests, forest.com and forest1.com. So we can create a trust between them. So whatever uh, printer or resources like some documentation which we have in different forests, users can access it even if it's different forest. It's default between the domains of the same tree on the forest. So let's say we have a forest that is called server techno solution com and if we just promote few other domains below that it will have a default for a default trust between each other wherein they will they will share the resources with each other like printer or users can see each other's data or so on and so forth now when it comes to two different forest or domains of different forest we need to create the trust so there are two kinds of trust, default trust and a, which is by default and there is another trust wherein we need to create it. So let's not, dis, you know, just confuse into that. Let's discuss all the trust one by one. So types of trust, one way trust, two way trust, external trust, transitive trust, non transitive trust, forest trust shortcut trust, tree root trust, parent child trust. I know guys, this is, I mean, this is really too much for all of us. But still, let's let's go uh, to each trust one by one. So what is one-way trust or two-way trust? One-way trust is a trust wherein resource can be accessed only one way. way. For example, this is our tree servertechnosolution.com child1.servertechnosolution.com child2.servertechnosolution.com so this is a tree which we have within which they can actually go ahead and access the resources of each other like if there is a printer installed in servertechnosolution.com child.servertechnosolution.com users can access that now this is this becomes and let's say we have different tree, other tree that is called techno solution server techno.com under which we have child one dot server techno.com child two dot server techno.com and printer is still under server techno solution.com so how we go ahead and let the let this forest or any specific domain access that printer so we create one way forest one way trust part wherein users of this whole forest can access the printer sitting into server techno solutions however anything installed here cannot be accessed via server techno solution.com that is called one way trust so server techno solution.com can access anything which is under server techno solution.com but this one cannot access anything which is this is called one-way trust. Now what is two-way trust? Two-way trust is when two domains or two forests can access resources of each other. So I have given permission to both the domains or both the admins of both the domains have given the permission to each other forest or each other's domain to access anything. So if there is a scanner installed on servertechnos.com, server techno solution can access it and so on and so forth. Now let's come to transitive and non-transitive trust. 
we can also call it parent child trust and tree root trust i have covered everything in one slide so let's discuss that so transitive trust is a two way trust automatically created between parent and child domain so this is our parent and child domain wherein parent domain is servertechnosolution.com child is child1 so as soon as we promote a child domain within a root domain or a parent domain there's a trust between them they can access resources of each other that is what we call a parent child trust now this flows down from here to here and that is what we call transitive trust so i have promoted child1.servertechnosolution.com it's by default then i come back and then promote another domain that is child2 so it is just flowing without doing anything that is called transitive trust now we have this is parent child trust and tr transitive trust is something which flows by default now what is non transitive trust a non transitive trust is a relationship in a multi domain environment that is restricted just to two domains so let's let's explain it via diagram so this is another forest i would say now what i need is i don't want everyone to access everything in each other each forest or each domain so i ask the admin of server techno solution that i need to access something of your domain but not for all the domains but from only one domain how can we go ahead and do that then i create a trust between them wherein i mention that trust should be only between servertechnos.com and servertechnosolution.com it should not go beyond that that is called non transitive trust now external trust what is external trust external trust enable you to configure one domain in one forest to trust a domain in another forest so this is same which we discussed in non transitive trust so non transitive trust which we create between two domains of different forest is same as external trust so let's say in this example servertechnosolution.com needs some resources from child1.servertechnos.com i have created a trust between them so there is no trust between other four remaining ones there is a trust only between child1 techno servertechno.com and servertechnosolution.com they are talking to each other but no one else know about it or doing anything about it that is called external trust next is forest trust so guys transitive trust is something which flows by default like between parent and child forest trust is somewhat the same so external trust enables you to configure one domain i mean let's go by diagram here so what i did is i have actually created a trust between servertechnosolution.com and servertechno.com however it's a forest trust so each six domains which we have in this diagram can access each other or each other resources that is what we call forest trust shortcut trust so external trust and shortcut trust is same wherein we are creating the trust between two domains of different forest no one needs to know about it it's a requirement so according to our need we create a trust between two domains of two different forest that is called shortcut trust so guys this is what which we have it we had about the trust how can we see what all trust do we have in our environment so we have a screen that is called or we have a snap in that is called active directory domains and trust we go we open that right click on the name of the forest which we have and we click on trust right now i don't have any trust created with any one or any forest it is not going to show you the uh, 
parent child trust also i mean it is right now because we have only single domain it is not showing us anything however if we want to see what trust do we have we can come to the screen and see what all trust we have so thanks for watching this video guys uh, keep watching i'm i'll make sure that i'll keep prepare the uh, videos on different topics so that it can be easy for you guys to understand so thanks uh, guys and uh, have a nice day to subscribe to this channel so that you will get to know about my new video and uh, like also so that i can understand what exactly i am doing and how am i doing uh, you can put your comments also uh, to explain what exactly you need in another video or what exactly you want something different in this video so thanks guys and have a nice day bye bye